If you have a block of land that is on a slope, then this house in Diamond Creek in Melbourne will give you some clever ideas to help you deal with the fall of the land. Hi Gary, how are Hi, you? Hi Renee, really good, how are you? Yeah, very well, thank you. So what do we got here? This is our beautiful display home. It's on about probably three metres of, of fall. It's actually a sloping block, okay. uh, which is what we do. Okay. And we've designed uh, a display home, a split level display home. All right, well, let's yeah, go and have beautiful. a look. Yeah, come through. Okay. So this is the entry, if you like. Yep, yep, feature entry. Yep. It's going down onto our split level, so as the land is falling away, yeah. um, we've, we've tried to accommodate the, the home to okay. work with the, the natural fall. Because otherwise you'd have to build that up and with stumps and things. Yeah, and, and look, you'd be a, a lot higher out of the ground as well if you sort of continued on that one level. Okay. So this, this allows you to sort of come out the rear of the house close to, to okay. natural ground. And then we've got upstairs as well. Yep, then we've got all the bedrooms and sort of kids area retreat upstairs. Okay. So it's almost like three three levels here. Yeah, in a sense, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look. Sure. LP Warren Homes is a family-run business. So there's three of us daughters who run the company, uh, along with our father, Jeff. Jeff has had the company for over 40 years now, so he's got a lot of experience uh, with building and sloping blocks and sloping sites, uh, and his knowledge is invaluable. As well as being a family-run business, our subcontractors have been with us nearly as long as the company has been um, alive, nearly 40 years now, uh, and all their businesses are father to son uh, businesses passing down through the generations so not only is the uh, company run internally by family, but we feel like the subcontractors are really a bigger part of our extended family as well. When originally looking at a sloping block, it may feel like you're trying to build on the side of Mount Everest, uh, but in our designs, uh, we try to have the, the house walking in from ground level at the front Take the house taking the major uh, or the majority of the slope and then still incorporating a flat usable rear yard which is really important to clients. Okay so this obviously Renee is the main living space. Yeah that's right yep it's um, got meals and, and living and kitchen. Yep. Um, so it's sort of all open open plan. Yep. Um, beautiful rake ceilings through through here. Yeah, because you've because the, this this room is sunken and so the rear yeah. of the house, yep. you've got that room to actually. Yeah, go letting up. in the the northern aspects. So okay. Which is good for your energy Great. efficiency. So some features of the kitchen. You've got beautiful appliances. Your induction cooktop. It actually looks like a clear glass plate, but you've got the jets that that pop up, which is quite interesting. Um, it seems to be a, a bit of a hit with all the clients. And from the alfresco, you've got beautiful so, uh, servery uh, windows which go out into um, the alfresco area. Large 40 mil stone bench shops throughout, which are gorgeous. And then going through to the butler's pantry, you've got continuing the 40 mil stone uh, throughout the butler's pantry. And you've also got um, a freezer um, drawer in there as well, which is great for drinks or you can actually, it can be fridge or freezer. And then a glass door that accesses to the alfresco area. Renee, I really love this house. I mean, it's so, it's so set up for um, entertaining. Yeah, it is. It's, it's got a beautiful, um, beautiful alfresco area, which yeah. is off the, off the living space, um, which can be really utilised for indoor, outdoor dining. Well, let's go and have a look. Sure. So, Renee, are we inside or outside here? It feels like we're inside, but we're actually outside. This okay. is our, our alfresco area. Okay. So what happens there, that blind just comes up? Yeah, that's right, That can you can just lift that up and access outside. Okay. Um, and same with our beautiful louver windows, which you can open up and let the breeze through. Beautiful. And obviously you serve through this window here. Yes, yeah, that accesses the, the kitchen, so yep. if you're barbecuing or whatever, you can use that as your, your servery. Love the roof. Yeah, cedar line ceilings, they're beautiful. This home's suited for uh, a family with probably teenage um, kids where the master bedroom's actually downstairs. So the kids really have that, that separate space upstairs for themselves and the parents can be, you know, downstairs as well. But then, you know, the the uh, rear of the house is the open plan, kitchen meals, living where everyone can come together. 
Each of our homes are individually designed for the client's block of land. So you won't have two homes ever the same. Uh, you may see our display home and like features of it uh, and we'll work uh, with you on your block to give you some of those features but also make it unique to you. We're also old time builders so we stick build our houses. We prefer a timber subfloor so that uh, you can get in under the floor with your heating and ducted vacuuming and things like that uh, rather than building on slabs where you do have to excavate more. It's a great example of what can be done with a sloping block. Thank you so much for showing me around, Renee. You're most welcome. Thanks no, for visiting. No worries.